How's it going guys, Blaze6344 here reading you a nice little craft bucket plugin tutorial on how to use my menu, the lightest, no not the lightest, just kidding, uh, a really great plugin uh, for your convenience and for lazy people. <laughs> not in a bad way, just saying. So basically, uh, what is my menu? My menu is a... Um, a plugin where you can put items into it, which you can't take up by the way, and uh, you click on it, you bind a command onto it, and then it does executes that command from the console or from the player. Hard to explain, I'm really bad at explaining stuff, so I'll just show you. So, once you have the plugin installed, if you don't know how to install the plugin, uh, the tutorial on how to install any graphic plugin uh, will be on the screen right now, so you can go check that out. If you know how to install it and you haven't installed, then let's get started. Now, what you want to do is do dash mm open. So dash mm open is a uh, the syntax of uh, opening up a menu. Keep that in mind, rule of thumb. So when you open a menu, you have to put in the menu name. So you do dash mm open welcome. Welcome is a default uh, menu that the developers put in so that you can see what the plugin is like. So enter boom, you have a menu filled with all the stuff. Uh, which you can do yourself too, which I'm going to show you later. But first, we see all these items, you can't take it out, uh, but then when you click on it, um, it will execute a command. So you can see the description of it, so if I click this, it will set time today. So when I click on it, boom, it sets everything today. Cool? Alright, let's get started on how to uh, set up this plugin, or how to use this plugin. So, basically what you want to do is do dash mm create, and then the name of your plugins, uh, name of your menu. So uh, random name, dirt. <laughs> no, uh, uh, Nigel, that's my first name. So, uh, mm create Nigel, and then you can, uh, well, you could be done here. If you press enter, you have a set amount of six rows of the, uh, the uh, menu. But then you can also set how many rows you want it to be. So, Nigel Blaze, and then you can set how many rows. So, three, boom, you have three rows. So, you can do that. So, now once you have your little menu open, uh, be sure not to click on anything unless you know what you are doing. So, uh, we can create a menu item. So, we can just click on any square here. Boom. So, it will say create new item. Enter material type. So, we can set it as diamonds. We can set it as dirt. We can set it as stone. Whatever. So, we'll just do stone. Boom. Uh, item, stone. And then, how many items do you want in that menu block? So, you want 64 items or it's one? It really doesn't matter. It's just for looks. So, uh, for looks, then one. Boom. So, how many commands do you want to run? Um, let's say, let's say uh, two. Okay, two commands. Uh, you can set it as one. Usually, it's one, but then let's set it as two. All right. Enter command one. So, now we have a bunch of tips. We said we have color, so we can do for color right you know color codes I hope you know that so basically let's start off with a console command so that we put in a start a dollar sign at the front of the command so then we can do say hello and then wild cards what are wild card wild cards basically it's a thing for my menu so player so this is this will say hello blaze x this is basically a data type uh, for your uh, for your guys so <laughs> Hello, player. You are in world. So, what world are you in? Uh, there's a bunch of other data types where you can check out in the bucket page in the description. So, uh, so you can enter. Boom. Now we can. We have. We entered that uh, command. Now we can enter command two. So let's make it a player command. So let's say uh, 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 D hop blaze next three four four. Okay. All right. So basically. Uh, remember no dash at the front Please please no dash at the front. That is a rule of thumb. So once you enter that boom Now you can enter the item name uh, is stone, but then you can enter it as uh, you know color code. So let's do uh, 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 Diop, okay, that's the title of our item menu name and then item lore. So item lore basically uh, how many lines of description do you want on your thing? So we can say uh, two item lore number one so it's like this will say hello to you and then the number two so you can do a color code three um, and and also you. okay so now once we open up our menu dash mm open 
uh, Nigel Blaze, I, I think that's my thing, yeah. So, now you can see Diop, this will say hello to you, and also Diop you, so, once I press this, boom. Hello Blazex344, you are in world, you are no longer up, Diop Blazex344, oh no, I am not up anymore, um, that is a-okay, because I'm already done with this tutorial, so, <laughs> uh, all the down links for this plugin will be in the description below, and... Yeah, have a nice day. Blaze X three forty four out.